Performing Arts, my name is Nicholas Brown, and I am the Director of Special Productions and Initiatives at Washington Performing Arts. We are so thrilled to be here with you tonight and partnering with the Kennedy Center to present one of our 2018-19 Mars Urban Arts Initiative Ensembles and Residents, Vivi and the Rebels. Washington Performing Arts presents this project, which is called the Mars Urban Arts Initiative, and it's been around for about five years, and it's a really amazing program that offers a platform to DC-based and DC-area artists to expand their performances around the city and the region, and also to engage in arts education work. This season, we have two ensembles in residence, Vivi and the Rebels and DuPont Brass. They represent some really diverse musical styles that uh, are very interdisciplinary and are a really great hallmark of the sound of the District of Columbia. Vivi and the Rebels has performed with us throughout the season already, started in the summer with an appearance at the Library of Congress. They've also performed at the farm at Kelly Miller, which is an urban farm in Ward 7. Uh, they'll be at the Line Hotel in Adams Morgan on Saturday at 5 o'clock, and will be joining us in the spring for some educational workshops in Anacostia, as well as a main stage concert at 6th and I, which is a double bill with DuPont Brass. We encourage you to check out our website, WashingtonPerformingArts.org, for all of their upcoming appearances, and also to check out the full list of season concerts for the Mars Urban Arts Initiative. Some other Kennedy Center events that we have coming up that I'd like to point out to you is uh, next week, on December 5th, our Children of the Gospel Choir will be performing a special holiday concert here on Millennium Stage at 6 o'clock. And then on December 6th, we'll be up in the Terrace Theater with a recital by pianist Simona Dinnerstein, which will be really amazing. Uh, Washington Performing Arts is one of the, the most active uh, musical and uh, performing arts organizations throughout the city. We are active in all eight wards of the city, as well as Maryland, Virginia. We are live streaming all the time. Uh, and we really appreciate your patronage of this concert and all of our concerts throughout the season. Please vi do visit our website and then also join us on social media as well as the Kennedy Center social media. Tonight our hashtags are Mars Urban Arts and Millennium Stage. And without further ado, I will welcome up Vivi and the Rebels. Let the fire burn, let the fire 
fire burn They said let the fire burn Let the fire burn Thank you. We're Vivi and the Rebels, and we're really excited to be here tonight. Um, this is our first performance at the Kennedy Center on the Millennium Stage. Um, so it's an honor to be here and an honor to um, be a part of the Washington Performing Arts um, Mars Urban Arts Residency. Uh, so we'll be doing um, original and cover songs for you tonight. Um, the first song that we did is called Move, and um, I wrote it after watching a movie about the Move 9 from Philadelphia called Let the Fire Burn, and was inspired by their story, um, and so I wrote that song in reflection. This next song is called Tulum. Don't let fear rule you. Don't let 
I think uh, now um, it's, it's especially important to make sure that we don't allow fear to take over our lives, right? Um, we have somebody ruling over our country in a way um, whose whole kind of platform is based on fear. Um, but in these times, I think it's important that we maintain that light and not uh, play into that fear um, that is being spread across this nation and across the world, um, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> so this next song is a cover song, it's by Bob Marley, um, and my middle name is Marley, and my mom is here tonight, um, and she named me after Bob Marley, and so some of my earliest memories are listening to Bob Marley, uh, Buffalo Soldier, um, but tonight the song we're gonna do is called Zimbabwe. the right to decide his own destiny and in this judgment there is no partiality so arm in arms with arms we fight this little struggle cause that's the only way we can overcome our little trouble brother you're right you're right you're right you're right you're right so right, we gonna fight, we gonna fight, oh, we gonna fight, fight for our right. Nachi Dreda in a Zimbabwe, Nash Tubba in a Zimbabwe, Africans are liberated. Zimbabwe, I and I liberate Zimbabwe. 
No more internal power struggle. We come together to overcome the little trouble. So soon we'll find out who is the real revolutionary. Cause I don't want my people to be contrary. And brother, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're so right. We gonna fight, we gonna fight, oh, we gonna fight, fight for our rights. Now you dread a in a Zimbabwe, mashed up in a Zimbabwe, Africans are liberated, Zimbabwe. So soon we'll find out who is the real revolutionary. Cause I don't want my people to be tricked by mercenaries. Brother, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're so right. We gonna fight, we gonna fight, oh, we gonna fight, fight for our rights. Match to in a Zimbabwe. Trash it in a Zimbabwe, Africans are liberated Zimbabwe, I and I are liberated Zimbabwe, Nashed in a Zimbabwe, Nat Trash it in a Zimbabwe, Africans are liberated Zimbabwe. I'm about like six months pregnant, I think. <laughs> and I have this big belly, and it's uncomfortable. Uh, <laughs> it's kind of hard to play the guitar now. Uh, so I'm, ex I'm glad that uh, we have two shows left this year, and then I can have a baby, and then I can get back to playing. Um, but my son, I have an almost seven-year-old son. He's in the audience, and his birthday is tomorrow. He's raising his hand up. Uh, <laughs> which is really exciting. And uh, I started playing the guitar, uh, I guess when I was pregnant with him, seven years ago. Um, he tried to come really, really early, and so I had to be in the hospital for a while, and uh, all I could do was like sit there and watch movies and play the guitar. So thanks, Ja. <laughs> okay. okay. This next song is called Cosmic Mother. Oh, 
Don't have tools to fight. Come. 
That song is called Quarrel. It's by Moses Sumney. Uh, this next song we're going to do is called Follow the Light. said you would follow me, follow me to the end of the world, baby girl. Follow me, let's be free. You said you would follow me, follow me to the end of the world, baby girl. Follow me, let's be free.
Patriots. Mm. Four years? We've been playing? I don't know. I don't know. Well, we've been playing for a while. <laughs> I don't know how long. And uh, we started out in Baltimore, getting a lot of shows in Baltimore, um, which was really cool and awesome. It was a great city, really different from DC. Um, I was up there for a class a few weeks ago, and they were like, DC is so different. And I, like, that's how we feel about y'all. Like, it's like another world. We feel the same way. Um, but this next song is called Baltimore, um, and I originally heard it sung by Nina Simone. Baltimore 
because we have a few songs left. Um, but in my day job, I'm a farmer, an urban farmer, which I guess is kind of cool. <laughs> um, so I work at the farm at Kelly Miller, which, where we had our show before this, and I work for an organization called Dreaming Out Loud, and we work on food access and food justice, um, mainly east of the river in Ward 7 and in Ward 8. And so that's what I've been doing, I guess, for the past, my whole adult career being a farmer, um, which is cool, you know, growing vegetables, uh, feeding people. <laughs> um, I'm really, I love herbs and love making medicines and make my children try out the stuff that I make. <laughs> like, I made this tea, try it. Or I made this cough syrup, try it. I made this, I made, Z doesn't like it. I made a rosemary castor oil infused with rosemary and holy basil that works really well, but it smells terrible. And Z hates it. And every time I put it on her, she's like, it smells like french fries. I'm like, why are you putting this on me? <laughs> she doesn't like it. It smells like the french fries her dad makes her. So she's like, ugh. Anyways. <laughs> um, so yeah, farming life. <laughs> Uh, so this next song we're going to do is called Sisters, um, and it's from our first, our only EP. <laughs> um, we have CDs for sale um, in the back, so if you like our music, uh, you can check it out at the end, and they're only $10. No, only $10. Okay, anyways. That's okay. All right. <clears throat> Sisters, a warrior. 
Thank you. So we have a few more songs for you tonight. Again, it was really an honor for us to be here. Um, and we have our final show of the year at the Line Hotel this Saturday. So if you'd enjoyed our show, you can come again. You can tell a friend, a loved one. Um, we really appreciate you all coming out to see us tonight. Uh, okay. So this is a, actually the first song I ever wrote. It only has one chord. <laughs> It was really hard to play the guitar. <laughs> so, um, but in honor of thanks taking, I guess, um, we'll be playing this song. Cowboy clean his gun, he shoot and kill for fun, he shoot and kill for land, he got blood on his hand, he watch your people die, see cowboy crack a smile, see cowboy take your land, he's an American, pick up your wounded knee, fight back the cowboy's greed, we call them colonists and white supremacists, he shoot and kill for fun, watch cowboy clean his gun, watch cowboy take your land, he's an American. Ever fight despite resistance from what seems to be our own kind. Never blind to the eyes that die our whole lives. Beneath this soil, America is a grave site. That's a fact. Looking back at what really happened, natives murdered in blood and had our land taken. Then gonna call it free. Then gonna tax me. Police attack me. So we attack back. Look here, my fist black. Better run, go duck shot it, air flack. We want our flag back inside the ground where our blood stained and we endured pain. We'll return the kings to restore things so that we can exist with this earth like human beings. But that requires change. What that really means is that you thugs gonna have to really bang. I'm just saying. 
talented band, The Rebels. We have Warren Peterson on bass. Everyone give it up for Warren. And this group is multi-talented and artists in their own right. We have Jason on the cajon. And we have Ajane Harley on lead guitar. And together we make up Vivi and the Rebels and the Afro folk sound. Um, our band members are from all over the diaspora. And so we come together and our music hopefully is a reflection of all of the places that we come from and um, a melding, a mixing pot of the diaspora of all of us coming together. So we have one more song for you tonight. It's also on our EP, and it's called Black August. And I wrote it um, after Mike Brown was killed. Black August gone 
Thank you again. We're Vivi and the Rebels, and we really appreciate being here. We hope you enjoyed the show. Thank you. Folks, thank you very much for joining us one more time here at Millennium State at Kennedy.